Hey, TB people, Howlin' Mad Mud Duck here, January 1st, 2019. Hope you're all having a good new year. Hope your day is going better than mine has. I'm fucked. Totally fucking shut down. Called up to the hospital to check on the goofy bitch and, uh, gal I talked to and me did not get along and evidently, if I ever call back again asking about her, they will have me arrested for, and charged and arrested for harassment. I think I called her a cunt because she couldn't understand normal thinking when I was busy trying to explain to her shit and she didn't want to hear it, I don't know. And the bitch could barely speak English as it was. Uh, my texts are getting rejected again. So I guess Blondie don't want to see me or hear from me or know about me or... I'm being blocked from her somehow. Don't know if it's her idea or somebody that thinks they're running shit around here's idea. I am a little perturbed. More than perturbed. Then... Check my bank account, and there should have been some money in there that wasn't put in there, and uh, I get nice fancy emails telling me my services are no longer required. So, that source of income is gone. Got that kicked in the gut, kicked to the curb feeling, and I, usually I would say, fuck it, I'm going fishing, but I have done something besides that. I broke this cocksucker out. This is for emergency purposes only. It's only 151 proof. I mean, fuck, I couldn't find goddamn 190 proof. And I tried. I was looking for 190 proof. I mean, what the hell's drinking Everclear? If it ain't 190, 151. Goddamn people in life, 75% alcohol. I got family members that piss stronger shit than this. And you know who you are. And I am sitting here contemplating, should I take this down a couple more inches? Not like the old days when I could drink a fifth of fucking whiskey, but, uh, yeah, extremely flammable, handle with care. Warning, overconsumption may endanger your health. Do not apply to open flame, keep away from fire, may ignite or explode, do not consume in excessive qualities, not intended for consumption unless mixed with non-alcoholic beverages. Well, hell, that gives me every reason to drink this shit, then. All right. familiar I think I'm gonna get fucked up tonight been a long time since I got drunk probably the only member of the family that don't drink 
you're the only member over 18 of the family over 18 that don't drink. I am not practicing because I got it perfect and quit. Ah. Oh, yeah, that's warm in the tummy. Yeah, what the hell? Let's go for another shot of this shit. It used to burn less when I was younger. We'll put that away now. But I took her down from oh, about here. about here to you down to there so my now tolerance for alcohol ass is gonna get a little bit toasty here in a few minutes oh that burn's coming back up so Don't remember getting drunk when she who shall remain nameless and me went our separate ways. And I should have. Said fucking went fi fishing. Oh yeah, that's not setting well on my empty stomach. Wonder how that interacts with my fucking medications. Oh well, who the fuck cares? Last time I remember getting drunk over a woman is when I climbed into that bottle after Linda run off with what's the fuck's his name. Took my son away from me. Climbed into a bottle for a few months and was comfortable. Knew every word of Whiskey River. And then I got back out of the bottle, got clean, and said no more. I don't drink because I don't like the person that can make me. I can either be happy and dancing, or I can be suicidal and depressed, or I could just go total fucking snap and want to kill everybody. so I don't know how this is going to affect me. I know I've got an empty stomach because I haven't eaten today. Don't remember if I ate yesterday. think I had a pizza, the half a pizza the day before that was just nasty. Damn Domino's, their quality has gone downhill, but I thought I wanted a pizza. So I'm just sitting here drinking alone, which is not good. She'd probably go out and get something to eat, but I've been drinking, and I shouldn't be trying to navigate the truck down the fucking roadway if I am getting myself intoxicated, which I feel creeping up on me. Oh, well. 2019 sucks already. And it ain't even midnight yet on the first. <laughs> uh, just when you think things are going right and future looks good and things look ho hopeful and promising and get your fucking knees kicked out from underneath you and just totally everything goes to hell in a few minutes. Oh, well, what was I thinking, getting hooked up with a fucking meth whore to begin with? Yeah, bitch, I called you a whore. Yeah, that's okay. Gonna miss her, though. 
It's easier to put the boat in the back of the truck with a little help. I didn't run out on her like she was scared of. Evidently, she just decided, uh, or somebody decided. I'm not too sure who's making the decisions right now. I got a clue. And that's a good idea. It's a good reason for me not to drink because drunk enough I might confront this person. And I just might be a violent drunk. I don't know. Just got that fucking kicked in the gut feeling. Feels like a mule kicked me in the gut. And if you guys ever been mule kicked, I don't advise it. Yeah. I have no fucking idea what to do now. We used to say smoke a bowl and think about it, but, uh, don't feel like smoking a bowl to think about it. Hell. This is probably the longest you people ever seen me without a cigarette. I got a pack set in here, got a pack out in the truck, got a shitload of tobacco and paper tubes and rolling machine set in here, and I just don't feel like smoking a cigarette. So I know there's something wrong with me. I am just I don't know I don't know if I'm depressed if I'm upset if I'm angry if I'm disappointed uh, well there's my hair tie I was looking for disappointed fucking I'm confused. I know that much. I am still missing the dog. Sit up there with her for a few hours today, talking with her, and as usual, she wasn't keeping up her end of the conversation. But she's been dead for four or five months, so yeah, she ain't going to keep up her end of the conversation. Cleaned the leaves off her grave and fixed up her lights around her grave and all that, which are... Yeah, they're still going, her solar lights. Uh... I'm going to be in beautiful shape for my appointment at 8.30 tomorrow morning. i got to get up at 6. So I'll probably sleep most of it off, but I'll look like hell. You know, this is enough of this goddamn mumbling on about nothing. Things were looking good. Things were looking bright. Things are looking, 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 looking. I'm just looking for the exit. I'm just feeling like I'm going to get sick already. I have no tolerance for alcohol. Okay, I was born with no fucking talent. I got whatever enzyme in the body helps digest alcohol. I'm lacking that. I have no fucking tolerance. I'm a cheap drunk. And... I just don't fucking know anymore. But 
I'm not suicidal or fucking thinking about hurting myself or anybody else. I'm just numb. That's it, numb. And this son of a bitch, you see how much is still in that fucker? And I've had this fucker for about a week, so... I really haven't been smoking. We need to go somewhere, do something, see some people. I don't know, I don't have any people left to see. Yeah, enough of this shit. I'm starting to depress myself.